Hey you guys, Gameboy3D under here once again for Company Gaming. We're back in SnowRunner Hard Mode. Had a successful oh, yeah. last episode. You got upgrades. We rescued trucks. And I upgraded this one. We're going to the town storage. Pick up some trailers. And then we should be able to start doing some of the contracts. So, that'll be fun. Alright. So we'll unlock, oh, yeah. unlock warehouses. And get us the big bucks. I do like the big bucks. The biggest bucks are the log missions, though. And, uh, unfortunately, the Fleet Star is just not too great at that. It can't have anything larger than small logs on the back of it. I think it can have like log carrier fronts for the long logs, but that the log carrier front and the log carrier rear combined is twenty grand. So no, thank you. Yeah. As soon as we can do some basic jobs, uh, I'll be able to put the crane on this truck and have it be pretty usable. Maybe I'll even put it on the GMC just so that can have some use. Right now, it's got enough. I mean, if it's just craning stuff around the garage, it's fine. It doesn't need all-wheel drive for that. Where I are can you catch up to you? What were you doing at the garage? I thought you was ready to go. My engine wasn't turned on. Cope. Ah, there you are. Hello. Mm. Are you still in leaders? And meters? No, no, I switched it. Okay. Yeah. Alright, then how big your fuel tank? Four gallon. Mm -hmm. I'm at 60. Out of 64. Alright. <laughs> what are you honking at me all the way back there for? I'm not in your way. You need uh, some uh, <coughs> Okay. You need some assistance? Uh, nope. Oh, okay. Do you? No. I'm going past the gas station right now. I didn't, didn't put a snorkel on this truck, but it shouldn't matter. Ah, I did. How much is gas? Eight dollars a gallon? This is a Michigan, it's California. I just want to know, where's all the people? They're in their house, man. On a nice day like this? Yeah, man. Uh, it's COVID era, you know? They they don't want to go outside. Mm. This game came out in like 2020, you know? <laughs> Bunch of pussy! <laughs> Alright, so over here... There's a trailer with spare service parts and bricks, if you could grab that. Okay. Now, uh, let's see if I can... I'll get it to an easier spot for you. There you go. Resident quiet zone, please be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately. Yeah. That's not where I want to go.
Alright, trailer is attacked. Very nice. Where to? Back to garage. Okay. I've also found in the trailer I'm going to be using. What the? I've been promoted. Very nice. Yeah. It makes sense you'll be a few stars ahead of me since you did your missions. And then me doing my missions also gave you the same amount of stars, so. Looking at my map, making sure I was going the right way. Mm -hmm. Not a good, or not a bad idea. Should have seen that man. I was up on how many wheelers is on my left side? Uh, three, four, five left wheels. But I saved it. Left down to the bridge. The trailer's doing some funny, but it's fine. Is it twerking? The wheelers are kind of phasing in and out of existence, but it's not twerking, so it's fine. How I want to be phasing. Okay. Mostly out of existence. Same. Be careful here. Like, one time I had like one of the ruts here just tip me over for the no reason. What are these game physics? I brush up against oh. a tree, but then it just brings me to a grinding hole. Let's go. Very nice. Fine, I'll go left instead of like trying to go right and avoid some of the mud. Just yeah, I tried to do that and it just like sunk me back into the ruts. Yeah.
Alright, so now we should have everything at base that we'll need. Oh. Got repair supplies, got some items. We may have to go back to town storage every so often for metal beams, because, like, uh, the game mm -hmm. loves to use those for everything, even if it doesn't make sense. Like, one time you'll see a completely wooden bridge somehow need metal beams. It's like, what are you doing, game? <laughs> You good up there, or you're waiting for me? Good. Okay. okay. That deep mud, man. Mm. Got it in low with a anti diff. The diff lock on. Yeah. That bush grew real quick. Hmm. Did you already drive through it in its back already? Yeah. It just, like, kind of grew as I was approaching. Oh, nice. Brand new game, man. Can't handle it. You should be able to run at pretty much max settings. I was about to go check my graphics. I know the only thing I have turned down is MSAA. I have that down to like 2x instead of like 8x that I could go to or whatever. Other than that, I got everything on highest. Oh, that is a lot more crispy. Looking good? Yeah. Alright, what now, man? I would like to get a little loading crane attached to one of my trucks, but I think it's just too expensive for me. I could sell off the GMC and have more than enough, but, uh, how about I? I don't. The fleet the shirt crane. The one that's like thirty seven fifty, yeah. The yellow one. It's not the top one. It fits like right behind your cab. Yeah, I see it. It's fifty seven. Same thing. <laughs> Let's 
so... All right. Here's what we can do, Thomas. Okay. The plan. I have unpacked the cargo on the flatbed here. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were going to buy that crane. Never mind. I wasn't. I don't have enough money. Cool. I only have $650. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Alright, well, we can still do this as like a two-truck convoy kind of thing. There's a bridge we can build, and we have all the supplies needed for it. All right. If you hook up to that red trailer there with the metal beams, and I... The one that I brought in? Uh, not the one you brought in. The one uh, left the of one. the service trailer. If you hook up to that, we'll have metal beams. And if I hook up to this, I'll have more than enough spare service parts. There we go. And now we take a slightly difficult route from off-roading, one could say. And we have a go. Alright, I'll let you go in front so you know where the fuck you're going. Ooh. Going right? This... Mm-hmm. We should check, though. Is it going to be concrete blocks or a spare service parts for the bridge up ahead? So, I'm going to turn off the truck, and we're going to go investigate in the Chevys. Imagine using a truck what it's used for. To, to go scout the area out. Who would have thunk it? How do I go back to the garage? Go to your map and just down on D-pad until you find garage entrance and double hit A. Okay. Did you put on all terrains on your, on your truck? I did. All right, I did not. I'm saving my money. Damn, this thing hates to fucking steer. Jesus Christ. The more off-road oriented your tires get, the less on-road performance you have. So did you just smash into a wall? Yeah, I did. How much damage did you sustain? Quite a bit. Like 36 engine. Interesting. Best way to go is through here. Maybe not. Hold on. I say best way to go. The actual best way to go is currently being blocked by a power line. Hey, hey, George. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> At least you have the auto winch, right? Yeah. I don't. Other than lifted suspension, my truck is stock. <laughs> Come over here, Cletus. Yep. There we go. Let's follow this road all the way up to the gas station.
Oh my, it's $12 a gallon here. What the hell? <laughs> right. But there's a huge semi tanker here that we can just mm -hmm. steal fuel from for free. Sure, I'll do that because why not? We could just steal that and bring it back, but we already have two fuel tankers at base, so we'll just leave that there and pick it up for the mission once we clear the way up here. Ready? I'm already up the road, Boober. I'm right behind you. Mountain bridge, what are your details? We need metal beams and concrete blocks. So it's not for service parts. I'm gonna accept it. Start tracking. And then up this way is a watchtower. Kinda wanna do that. Will it have a wind sock? That's a good question. <laughs> having, having fun there? Yeah. Did find the upgrade location. It'll be the SnowRunner gearbox for us, so it'll be a four speed but with three low speed gears. So we can easily do low gear stuff. Or which uh, truck? Chevy. Oh, cool. Chevy and pretty much any other scout. Don't bunk that rock. I may have taken 25 engine damage for no reason. I may have. It's not confirmed, though. Crying about little bitch. Uh, my engine ha health is at a half. Huh. By drifting past the light pole, the game couldn't handle it and said, "Nope, you're taking engine damage." <laughs> so we need concrete. Blocks. That means I need to put my trailer away and grab the the ramp slot bed. Uh, you can continue on though with the metal beams. Okay. Funk. Good job. 
I'm gonna park next to... Oh! Same thing for me. I'm gonna park next to the service trailer so I can let the truck repair it. Why do you go that way? If you park your Chevy next to it too, uh, I can repair it as well. Get into it. I kind of parked in my way. I need to connect to the trailer to repair. Ah! There you go. Thank you. If I had the crane, I would... Uh, Pick put, me up. Put two of these concrete slabs into uh, my bed, but uh, I don't, so. That trailer. This will be a heavy one to me. Need to get into my truck. I'm putting my Chevy back to the garage. All right, and my fleet star. Getting foggy. You're probably gonna be lighter, so you can go ahead if you need to. <laughs> trying to help you, man. Yeah, I was trying to help me too. Interesting. Um, very interesting. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I guess you go over there. I'm gonna need you to let me winch once you get up the hill a little bit. Yep. Interesting. We could just take the road up the power line in town. I forget, probably metal beams and like spare service parts. That's like what this game needs for everything. Okay. You able to hook on? Yeah. Just don't let me tip that trailer over. I'll disconnect if I see it move too much. I really I'm not looking behind me right now.
Good? I thought I was. Drive. Yep. There we go. Come on, Bessie. Why am I having so much trouble? I had the same upgrades as you. In fact, I should be better powered to weight ratio because I don't have a sideboard bed. Oh, I guess I do have a much bigger trailer on me. I could also be it. Call me crazy. I guess I'll just brown nose myself into you. <laughs> Any more solid trees here, that would be better. Alright, this is slightly slower than it was before, I'll admit. I'm not getting anywhere. Really, the only thing that's over there. The tree that'll just immediately pull down. Cool. Interesting. Are you still stuck down there? I've gotten to. Or are you waiting on me? I wish I could say I was waiting on you. <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting on you, man. I'm waiting on you to back down here so I can get a winch. Good luck backing down with that trailer, though. They suck ass. Hey Thomas, you yeah. know what you know what time it is. Chevy time. Chevy time. <laughs> oh, that's yours. Once I get up this hill, I will go grab the Chevy. I'm already on my way with it, brother. Your Chevy. My uh, Chevy? Alright. With the uh, slightly better tires. Supposedly. Aren't you glad I didn't put it in the fucking garage? No. Hey Thomas, about your Chevy. Yeah? How did, did you flip it? I didn't flip it, I just kinda stopped moving as soon as I touched this mud.
All right, you know what? You you have your Chevy back. You don't like my Chevy? No, it's too blue. George, bring me my Chevy. You gotta teleport to it, Boozer. What the fuck did you do? I tried to go that way and the game said no. Probably help if I was in reverse as you're pulling me back. That may help. Not confirmed though. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, I do have the auto winch. I forgot to put that on, I guess. We. George. George. Oh, you. Come need back. I'm stuck. <laughs> you, need, you need help, yes? Yes! Hmm. The Ford guy asking the Chevy for hell. Fuck mm. Ford! <laughs> Don't you have a great story about Fords? Fuck Ford! I'll never get another goddamn Ford. I want to get a Ford. I'll get a classic Ford, not on the new one. Yeah, obviously. Oh, good job. How well, did you I was trying to get around you. I left you plenty of room. You're a retard ass. Hey, I'm not ass. All right, uh... Okay. Yes! Yes! The power of double winches. Alright, you want to get to the top of the hill, and then no. you go back to your truck, and get, get I'll to come the back with this? Get, get to the gas station. Uh, that's what I meant. Gas station. I have my truck, too, right in front of my truck. These are both your trucks. Now we're moving. I know. Wasn't sure if you wanted me to use mine to get yours. Mm, you can use mine to get mine. I would go to the right a little bit more. Less mud. What are you doing? Healing. I thought you were just going to smash right into that. <laughs> smash into it and explode. I'm making it.
Don't forget to turn off your engine. Yep. I think we're one foot too far away from that thing to refuel. Alright, you can swap to the other Chevy. I don't know why this works so well. I don't either. But it does. Only in multiplayer too. Like if you're in single player and like attached to your scout, all you do is like pull the scout back. And multiplayer is like magic. You get ahead of me. Like more ahead of me rather. Alright. That's it. Go to the right a bit. So do you have to do this when you play with Dylan, also? Well, Dylan and I are max level in our playthrough. So we have the best trucks, so we don't have to worry about uh, doing what we're doing. Yeah. But we did. When we first started out, you know? Mm-hmm. I made my truck green. Who is Ronald McBurger King? What? Who is Ronald McBurger King and why is she playing GTA? I don't know. Dang. I thought Marky he Jester's brother? He knows. Bro, you parked in the, my way. Sorry. I thought you were just gonna go main entrance, man. Or main road. Didn't know you are going to the gas. Yeah, I filled up your truck. I'll fill up your truck. Sure, you didn't just put fuel from your truck into the tanker. I haven't done anything yet. All right, well, they should all be filled up now. Mm 
Bonk. Are we going to need the Chevy? I don't know. What are you honking at me for? I don't think only the Chevy's because there's like plenty of trees on the left. But let me you winch to them. Good boy, y'all. Why? We were holding hands. I will alt that for the game. <laughs> you lunch me. I'll let you get all the way ahead first instead of trying to pull your right. metal beamers off. Yeah, you're on the road now, right? Yeah. All right. All right. So once you get to it, do cargo management and just like spam A for a metal beam should be done, and then I'll eat, I'll do the same and put on the concrete. All right, metal beams done. Concrete blocks done. All right, promoted $1850. Just keep going. Uh, up ahead, there's going to be a rock slide that requires spare service parts to clear, but we can go right, to there's it. There's a warehouse up the up on the right. Yeah, but it won't tell us what's in it. There's a watchtower up here as well. We already got the watchtower right here. Oh. Um, I mean, there's that one ahead. I see it. Definitely feel the half load I have now. Right. Well, you don't have see watchtowers on the left. It looks like. If you go onto the dirt and then take the left path of that, uh, that's a way you could get to it. You want to go to the watchtower? You can. You can detach your trailer and go for it. I'm gonna go activate the mission for the rock slide. Alright. I won't have what's needed to do the rock slide, but I'll activate it. Alright, once you get up to the top of that, uh, should be like right next to the watchtower. You may have to slightly jump down something though. Just slightly. Yeah. You got this. That's not too. I did that in the P16 once and I fell over. <laughs> but I rolled back on my wheels, so I kept going. All right. All right, watchtower has been activated. 
I saw. And you're right, you could go to the warehouse on the right and pick up spare service parts if you wanted. It's a bit of a ways away, but if you have an empty bed, it shouldn't be a problem. There's an Oh, I think I took a wrong turn. Mmm. Maybe you did. If you can go like dead left, the road's there. There's a giant hill. You got. I cannot get up. You got this. How am I going to turn around here? That's a good question. Uh, I will grab a Chevy then. I'll bring your shoulder. I'm on my way, Thomas. I'm good. I'm on my way, Thomas. Just gonna go back down the way I came up. Okay. Well, when that fails, I'll be there. How's that going for you, Thomas? Too bad, actually. Hmm. Alright, uh... Wanna come over to the road? And go past the trailer? And follow me? This is the quickest way to the warehouse. Alright. Should I bring the trailer with me? No, you have a trailer on you already. The sideboard trailer. Oh, well, the flatbed. Mm, the flatbed's still attached to my truck up at the uh, place where I found the mission. So we're going to the warehouse? Yep. Get spare service parts, or we could go back to the garage and get them, but that requires, like, doing more trailer stuff and going the way we came and we know how well that went. Mm -hmm. The secret to the winch working in multiplayer is you connect to me and just pull. I don't feel it and you just go. like magic. Is that the warehouse over there? Yeah, the up arrow. Empty sideboard trailer there as well. We can leave it though. We don't need it. 
Alright, so just go into there and choose spare service parts. Since you don't have a crane, uh, you won't be able to do the manual loading platform, so you're going to have to auto load for like $300, but we should get like $1,300, $1,200 for this mission, so you'll get it all back. Okay, so what do I need to get? Spare service parts to them. Into the back of your truck. One, two, there you go. All right. And now I'm gonna path our way back to that. Quickest way is the way we came. Hold on, bitch. Can you change the horn sound? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get a different truck. <laughs> Some I'm trucks. Not sure if I could add like a fucking train horn. Some trucks do have like a uh, external horn. Jesus Christ, Jordan. <laughs> Some trucks do have an external horn like visual thing, but it doesn't change the volume or sound or anything. I don't have all-wheel drive on. Neither do I. Wait, you're in my truck, aren't you? Yeah. Because it had the tires. That said, I didn't notice too much difference switching between the two. Hi there. Hi. Oh god. <laughs> he flipped me over. Me? <laughs> yeah, you. What do you mean? I was taking the turn onto the road. How is it anyone else's fault but yours? So that's interesting. Um, how is this going to work out? Because I would like to flip you over and have your things back in your bed. Don't think that's going to work since we don't have a crane. Pull. Yeah, the cargo's falling out. Well, we still gotta get you over. Alright, uh... Like, no way to winch to it. So... I have an idea. I'm gonna pull over to the side okay. here. And if this idea fails, we still have a trailer back at base... ...with the spare service parts. But... I think if I... If we can use my ramped... Uh, towing thing to its advantage. 
like put down the ramps. Maybe we can push them on and pack them. Okay. Oh, maybe. Maybe not though. I gotta All find right. a way to. I gotta find a way to turn around though. Without dying, preferably. There. Oh, you left your truck. I or did. you left my truck. Okay. On my way. Okay. I miss it. Oh, 1.13 a.m. Very nice. Not even bad. All right, I think I have enough room to turn around here now. All right. Like how I can. Sounds like I can hear your truck. Sounds like it. <laughs> oh boy, I can tell you why that is. Oh shit! I see you now. <laughs> I didn't see. I couldn't see you before. I'm like, where the fuck is he? Some help. Yeah, I do. I'm in the Chevy. Thankfully, oh, God, George. We thankfully don't need the concrete blocks anymore. Hi <laughs> there. Nothing to see here, officer. I swear. I was like that when I got here. Far away, I am one inch away from it. There we go. Move. Thought you needed help, so I went myself to you to get you out of the mud. I wasn't in the mud. Now I am. I'm good. Slowly but surely, I'll make it. That's a guardrail. You good? Cause that still looks like a guardrail. So your plan is to push them onto your ramps? Yeah. Okay. You may need the bigger truck to push them. I don't know how heavy they are. Or if they'll just flip you over a hundred times, I don't know. Once it gets vaguely on, I should be able to activate the ramp and like flip it on and then pack it. If, if I could winch to the things, it would be... You are monster jamming over that thing. It would be, way, it would be way easier. Oh. Oh. I'm not sure that helped. It. I don't know. God damn it. Go get your other truck. 
All you're doing is kind of going into the same spot over and over again. I don't know how long we've been going, so let's leave it on a cliffhanger. Will he get it? No. We'll see you in the past. We're stuck in the past, Thomas. Ah!